For a fishing rod, bro? This man's excited about a fishing rod, bro. Look at reveal. Today, we're checking out some prime time slime time. Reincarnated as a slime. Listen, if you like the video, don't forget to like the video. Also, subscribe for more of this content. You can find the full length as well as exclusives over on Patreon. There's other links down in the description. If you're interested in checking out some non-anime reactions, some K-drama reactions, I do that on another channel. And maybe you want to stop by the Twitch stream so that way you could be like the beautiful people in chat. I mean, most of them are beautiful. Sometimes we get the, the one-off uh, cut my head off. What the fuck kind of name is that? Most of the people are beautiful though. So, so be like them. Stop by hang out with us have a good time now let's have a good time watching this anime the elite four bro i don't think anybody's gonna come close to our elite four i don't know who they are but i just saw diablo on stage and that's just crazy Wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. Benny, Maru, Shion, and Diablo. There's no way that anyone's gonna face these three. That's insane. I wanna say there's nobody in that whole arena stronger than Diablo, but I might be wrong. So does he feel like nobody else in this, in Tempest is strong enough? Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, because if they were in the tournament, it would be over, bro. One of them would win. Also, all hell would break loose, man. It would be like setting off a nuke in this city. In this, uh, in this coliseum, whatever, arena. Masayuki? Hey, let's go. That's pretty cool. I like that. Oh, this guy's extra. I don't like this guy already. Yo! Yo! Yo, the horse guy's got some beautiful eyes. It's still so cool that he can create this, like, dungeon that everyone can, like... It's like a giant game. That's kind of cool. Okay, well... That's homeboy, bro. That's carry-on, right? You know when you go and you catch a flight, right? You're allowed to bring one bag onto the plane with you in the overhead. Or maybe it's not. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, I could be wrong. I could be wrong. It, maybe it's somebody from that one village. Oh, never mind, bro. He's not the carry-on. He's the bald dude. In it, bruv. He gotta be the bald dude. Oh, okay. I didn't even think about him. Maybe, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see who it is. Yo, let's go, Gopta! Yo, why he's so scared coming up? <laughs> I like it, bro. I want him to be in there. Why did... Let's go! Geld! <clears throat> I wonder how many others, like, from the from everybody's gonna be in here, too. Oh, that's it. Oh, wow. Okay, so we got the horse, the bull, the cocky, the hero, the other guy with the hero, unknown, Gobta, Geld. Okay. Seems so extra.
That's so extra. What the hell was that? And Gold says, like, I don't want to challenge you. Rimuru, I don't want to challenge you. All right, so bracket is the bull and the horse fighting. That's bullshit. Wait, this feels like so dumb. I don't like this. Why are the bull and the horse fighting now? Why is Masayuki and homeboy fighting now? He's going to give up. We already know that. I'm, I imagine Gobta's going to win. Bolt, move on. Carry-on's going to beat Geld. Bolt, move on. This is the only match that I actually care about right now. Round one, this is the only one that matters. Bull versus horse. Oh, so true, chat. It's because of Masayuki's luck. The Mavericks versus the Bulls. Damn. They have very equal strength. Yo. Oh my fucking god. What are the odds? They just take each other out. Masayuki gets past his round by luck. Gets past this round by luck. Instantly in the finals. I know what's going to happen, dude. I can see it. Everybody's excited. They're like, yo, this is crazy. Lit animation. Oh, my Lord. He disarmed him. Yo, shit. Holy moly. He poked him full of hole. Wait, what? Oh, what the fuck? These guys are fucking broken. Pussy. This guy's whack. By the way, I wouldn't have even let him compete if... if Bro, I don't want that man back in my fucking country if he's going to act like that. You're not competing in any of my shit. You're not allowed, bro. Fuck you. You can come here as a normal person. You're not a warrior in my eyes. Come on, Gopta. You got this, bro. This man about to be so weak in your eyes. Eh? <laughs> Okay, stop Diablo. Come on, let's go, Gupta. Oh my god. Come on, dude. What is this? Go up to fight back. For a fishing rod, bro? Okay. Alright, sure, yeah. This man's excited about a fishing rod, bro. Okay. Damn. Damn, dude. Just got headbutted. So it's Gopta and Ron. That's not okay. That's like instantly so unfair. That's damn near a 2v1. Carry on versus Geld. Who wins? It's obviously the carry on, bro. Unless it is the Baldi. I, I really don't know who it is. It's either the Baldi or it's carry on. I don't know.
Damn. And they going in, man. Oh. Oh. Beast transformation, bro. Come on. Yeah. It's carry on, bro. Not enough. Come on, Geld. No, Geld! No! A fun scrap, bitch. What? Okay. That was quick. So now it's carry on versus Gulpta. That's rough. Carry on versus Masayuki. Masayuki, whatever. Wait. So basically, he's talking. Yeah, he's talking to Ojuzuing him, right? He's basically telling him, drop out here and then we can fight for real later. What? That's crazy, bro. That's crazy, bro. It's because of his hero charisma, Joe. No, it's because he's all luck. Everything just works out for him. If, if he fought against Rimuru, Rimuru might genuinely fucking lose. Because everything just works out for this man. Oh my god. Oh, well, that's what I... That's, wait, it's not luck, but yeah, his skill is the hero's charisma, right? My bad, my bad, my bad. It is called the hero's charisma. Carry on, bro. What'd I say, bro? The moment he came out, I knew it was carry on, bro. You cannot catch a flight without your carry on. It is kind of broken that they're like working together. Nah. Jesus Christ. He's the elusive samurai. Damn. That's not fair, bro. This is so unfair, dude. That's so crazy. They have to fight a demon lord, bro? Come on. Took off part of the mask. It's going to unveil that he is carry on. Technically, only like one of his hands needs to be out of commission, right? I like that. I like that. I like that, Gopta. So now it's Masayuki versus Gopta. I hope Gopta's immune to this uh, hero's charisma shit. That'd be lit. This is the most trash tournament arc ever. I don't know about most trash, but it is kind of disappointing the way certain things are handled. Oh my God, look at that food. Mmm, I want it now. 
Okay. Oh, it's crazy. I feel like we've seen this uh, tattoo somewhere. Bro, what we need to do, what we need to do is give Gopta some sort of like skill blocker thing where the charisma doesn't work on him. Ooh, that'd be dope. Bro, what is up with Raphael right now? Not. Um, dude, we're not even getting the fucking. Fu We have to wait till next episode for the actual fight. Maybe Raphael notices signs that Gobta will evolve or something. Maybe. I think Raphael wants to say something about Gobta. But is refusing. Edging us? 100%. Yeah, we're getting edged by Raphael. Listen, what did you guys think about the episode? Let me know down in the comments. And if you enjoyed the video, don't just leave a comment. Also, why not like the video and, and subscribe to the channel so you can check out more of my reactions to this, plus other isekai. We've got ReZero coming. Also, I'm streaming reactions to ReZero uh, on basically damn near every day, Tuesday through Friday. You can catch my re my rewatch reactions to ReZero that I have not seen for like four years, okay? Like, subscribe, as well as your comment. Until next time, I'm sure you all keep it fresh. Peace.